Alright, I have yet to tell you this, but, um, last Saturday, me and my dad, Austin, and Kenny, we all went to take scrap in. Um, and I had noticed the Cub Cadet that I wanted a couple of months back, and, um, I walked over to look at it, and I spotted a 1969 Jacobson 1200 hydrostatic. This thing is exactly like the Ford. It's missing a hood. The tires are flat on it. But, um, I made a list of all the things I'm going to grab off of it. Um, I am going to get all the stuff tomorrow. Hopefully the tractor's still there. I did tell the guy at the, at, um, the junkyard to hang on to it for me. That way I could, um, get the parts I need off of it. All the parts that are um, on this list are on there, except for I don't. I'm not sure about the battery box, but I'm gonna check and see if there is. All right, we got coil. I want the coil because coils are hard to find. Well, not really, but still like good to have. Carb, good. Electric clutch, exactly like the one that came off the Ford. So I'm grabbing that. Wiring, wiring's good to have. Rear hubs good to have. It's got seat cushions, the same, not the original to the Ford, because the original ones to the Ford were blue, but these ones are black. Um, four tires and rims. I'm getting the tires and rims off of them because they're all the same and original to the Jacobson. Headlights, the Speaker 7.7s, I'm getting. The switches, the deck, it's got a deck. Clutch pulley, which is what you hear when I start to Ford up the That's the sound that the bearing is going bad. Oh, uh, where'd I leave off? Um, hydrostatic knob. The um, where my not where my hydrostatic disengages, disengage, disengages and engages, so I could have neutral is not the original knob to it. That one, the Jacobson has it. The seat I can use to repair my seat. Battery box if there is one. The gas tank has the get the hole that comes the place where I need to. It comes out where it's supposed to come out on the Ford, so that's good. Um, shroud cover, that's a good thing to have. And then this is Austin's stuff because he's not around. He wants the ignition off the, he found a wheel horse there. He wants the ignition out of it, the hub, the plow, and then off the MTD, he wants the pole starter cover. So, that's my list of stuff, and, um, crap. And if I do end up getting the stuff, I will update you tomorrow on all the stuff I got. I will show you it. Um, so, um, here's some of the scrap I got. That's not even half of it. <laughs> I got a lot of stuff. It's 40 cents a pound to buy off of them. And I figured it up, and if, um, if it comes out to about 100 pounds, I'll have to buy it. I'll have... I have to have like 45 bucks. I have 20 on me now, so I'm pretty sure this is worth at least another 25 bucks. So that'll be good. Hopefully, it's worth more than that. Because the last thing of scrap we took in, we only got 36 out of, which was less weight than this. So hopefully, we get more. Got that old craftsman. But yeah, I'll update you tomorrow when I get the parts, if I get the parts. See ya.